and good morning to all of you here at this wonderful place in this wonderful country with so many people who are here for the same reasons in their hearts and with the same energy in their mindsets. And if we talk about energy and feelings after this really great big energy moment with Christian and Chris, I can truly feel a lot of energy here in this room. <laughs> but what exactly is this energy we are talking about? Imagine energy as the fuel for our bodies, just like gas or line for a car. We need energy to function, move, stay warm, breathe, think, digest food, and do all the things we do every day. But where does this energy come from? Well, the secret lies in our mitochondria, our body's power plants. Think of mitochondria as tiny power plants in ourselves that produce energy for our bodies. Mitochondria are little energy factors within ourselves. They are present in every cell of your body, except the red blood cells. This means we have approximately 36 trillion mitochondria in our body. The fascinating thing about these tiny entities is that we inherit them directly from our mothers. This means that most likely everyone here in this room has the same mitochondria, the same tiny entities passed down from generation to generation. It's like a maternal gift from the past that provides us with the energy we need to navigate through our life. Mitochondria can be imagined as small factories. They consist of the outer membrane, which acts like a wall that protects and controls what goes in and out the mitochondria. Then the intermembrane spell space, where small molecules are temporarily stored like in a front yard, and the highly folded inner membrane, which works like many conveyor belts to maximize production efficiency. And finally, there is the core or inner space, the heart, known as the matrix where raw materials are processed. Many important processes take place here, and this is also where the mitochondrial DNA and ribosomes are located. The fact is, everything we eat is converted by our body into energy, into ATP. And how does it do that? through a process called cellular respiration. This is where all the macronutrients, so the carbohydrates, the fats, and the proteins are converted into energy that our cells can use. The citric acid cycle is the central metabolic process in the mitochondria that extracts this energy from the nutrients. But what actually gives us the energy? This works because everything is converted into acetyl-CoA and fed into the so-called citric acid cycle, which takes place in the heart or the matrix of the mitochondria. There, ATP and the NADH are produced. ATP is the main energy source of the cell and NADH is responsible for transporting even more electrons to the electron transfer chain enabling the production of even more ATP. 
So ATP is like a charged battery that stores energy and can release it when your body needs it. When the cells in the body need energy, specific bonds are broken and the stored energy is released. This energy is used to perform various activities in the cell, such as muscle movement, nutrient transport, and also cell structure repair. Thus ATP is the battery that provides energy for the cell, and NADH is the truck that transports the energy or the electrons to the power plant, our mitochondria. This makes ATP and NADH a team that ensures the cell always has enough energy to perform its tasks. Without these two molecules, the cell could not survive, as it would have no energy to carry out essential functions. Thus, it is totally self-explanatory that the mitochondrion has an immense influence on various areas of our body. Healthy and well-functioning mitochondria can positively impact our body functions. However, there are also factors that can damage our mitochondria. What we want is to do something good for our mitochondria, to support them positively in their work, so that we have even more energy. This is where so-called mitoceuticals help us. Mitoceuticals are substances designed to support the health and the function of mitochondria. They can consist of various nutrients, plant extracts, antioxidants, and other bioactive compounds known to have positive effect on mitochondria. But now, let's take a look at some of them. I would like to start with L-carnitine, because L-carnitine plays a central role in our energy metabolism and is particularly involved in fat metabolism. Imagine L-carnitine as a truck driver who brings coal to the power plant. In our case, L-carnitine transports long-chain fatty acids into the mitochondria where these fatty acids are converted into energy. This transport process mainly takes place in the muscles as the energy demand is the highest there. Through this process, L-carnitine helps reduce our triglycerides, the free fats, and simultaneously increases our good cholesterol. We have the good and we have the bad cholesterol. The bad cholesterol is the LDL cholesterol, and the good cholesterol is the HDL, the hello, I do love you cholesterol. And this, it can be increased. However, for our body to produce L-carnitine, it needs certain vitamins and minerals. We need vitamin C, B3, B6, and iron. Therefore, it is important to also pay attention to a balanced intake of micronutrients. Alpha-lipoic acid, ALA, differs from L-carnitine in that it supports not fat metabolism, but sugar metabolism. ALA helps to introduce carbohydrates into this citric acid cycle thereby improving the energy or ATP production from these sugars. Thus, LAA is involved in regulating blood sugar levels and also in the formation of glycogen, our storage sugar. However, one of the main effects of LAA is the protection of cells, particularly our mitochondria, from external attacks and also from stress. ALA acts as a kind of protective barrier for our cells and mitochondria. Then coenzyme Q10. Coenzyme Q10 is a helper, a cofactor, for and within the energy factories and enzymes 
complexes of our mitochondria. Thus, CoQ10 symbolizes the workers in our energy factories who handle the transport of electrons, enabling the production of energy in the form of ATP. Normally, the body can produce CoQ10 on its own. However, from the age of 40, there is often a deficiency of CoQ10 due to increased consumption or reduced production and also absorption. Extracts of the ginseng root are used in traditional Chinese medicine for a variety of indications. The so-called ginsenosis, they contain primarily modulate the immune system, the hormonal balance, and the central nervous system. Ginseng root extract increases the organism's tolerance to physiological and also physical stress. This occurs through various mechanisms. For example, in stressful situations, one of the most important stress hormones, our cortisol, can be positively regulated, while at the same time, the oxidative stress in our cells and mitochondria can be alleviated. This means that on one hand, our physical and mental performance can be improved, and on the other hand, fatigue and exhaustion can be counteracted. In short, we become more stress resistant and efficient. Quercetin is a flavonoid, indeed the king of flavonoids, and is distinguished by its strong antioxidant effects. This allows it to neutralize substances responsible for the inflammatory process in the body. Particularly in cases of inflammation that go beyond normal levels, quercetin have an anti-inflammatory effect and also a positively impact on, on overall health. And at the same time, it protects against oxidative stress and reduces harmful substances in our cells and so in our mitochondria. Furthermore, quercetin can stabilize our allergy cells, the so-called mast cells. As a, result, as a result, fewer allergy mediators, our histamines are released, which can alleviate typical allergy symptoms. And then cordyceps. Cordyceps is a medical fungus from the traditional Chinese medicine that can modulate our immune system. It primarily reduces inflammatory processes in the body while increasing protective substances against stress in our cells and in our mitochondria. Therefore, cordyceps has strong antioxidant effects supporting the electrical membrane potential essentially the power source of our mitochondria. It can reactivate mitochondria under stress conditions, akin to a setting, a trip circuit breaker. We already know and we love all of these active ingredients. But now, I would like to introduce you to five new ingredients that complement this overall concept. First, our well-known Metapower oil with the familiar essential oils from grapefruit, lemon, peppermint, ginger and cinnamon. Thus, all the benefits these essential oils bring can complement the product and support our mitochondria in positively influencing our metabolism. The second new ingredient is PQQ. PQQ is a vitamin-like compound and also a fascinating antioxidant. Its antioxidant effects 
is approximately 5,000 times greater than that of vitamin C. PQQ is closely involved in the formation of new mitochondria and can positively influence the number of mitochondria which unfortunately decrease in function with increasing age. A PQQ deficiency can have significant impacts on our energy balance and our overall fitness. PQQ, like coenzyme Q10, is like a spark plug and fuel for the mitochondria, our engines of the cell. Santa Herba has a significant impact on our mitochondria too. This plant contains bioactive compounds that can support mitochondrial function by promoting energy production and cellular metabolism through their influence on various receptors. So-called ages at one's location and products, for example, are harmful compounds formed by excessive sugar intake and can lead to a massive oxidative stress. Santa Herba can help to reduce the formation of ages and thereby counteracting oxidative stress. Studies also suggest that certain components of Santa Herba poses antioxidant and anti-inflammatory properties that can protect mitochondria from oxidative stress and also improve our cellular health. The next two ingredients are only available in the European version of MetaPower Mito 2 Max. Okay, the first one is manganese citrate <laughs> and the manganese citrate is a remarkable element. It contributes to normal energy metabolism and positively affects also our fat metabolism, our cholesterol le levels and also our blood sugar levels. Manganese is also essential for maintaining healthy bones and cartilage as well as for the formation and normal connective tissue. Manganese is thus a fascinating trace element that plays a key role in our body and offers numerous benefits. As a component of the enzyme superoxide dismutase, it functions as a powerful antioxidant and protects our cells from damage. And the second one, and lastly, the pantotenic acid, also known as vitamin B5. This vitamin is crucial for the function of our mitochondria. The mitochondria are the energy providers of our cells. And this vitamin B5 plays a key role in fat metabolism by serving a building block for coenzyme A. And coenzyme A is essential for the breakdown of fats, carbohydrates, and proteins into energy in the form of ATP. Additionally, pentatonic acid influences the production of melatonin, our sleep hormone, thereby contributing to a healthy sleep-wake cycle. When we have sufficient pentatonic acid, this process runs smoothly and our cells receive enough energy for their functions when we can sleep better at night. When combining many different mitoceuticals, a synergy is created that can positively affect the health and performance of mitochondria. 
by combining several active ingredients, each supporting different aspects of mitochondrial function, a more comprehensive protection and a better support of the mitochondria can be achieved. This can help optimize energy production, reduce oxidative stress and improve overall cell function. In summary, the combination of various nutraceuticals can contribute to promoting cell health and long vitality. When we talk about synergy, we should also discuss the interplay of various popular products. One of them fits wonderfully with the theme of energy, and that is our Meta Power Advantage. I would like to take this opportunity to briefly summarize why we refer to it as an advantage and why the combination of MetaPower Advantage and mito max is so interesting. Here we have the power of marine collagen, NMN and 10 other synergistic ingredients to promote cellular integrity and also health. However, these three components are the ones I want to focus on because they can positively support our energy balance. First, NMN. The natural NMN contains precursors in the NAD plus biosynthesis pathway and it is a vitamin B3 derivative with excellent effects on gene expression. The NAD plus is a crucial molecule for cellular energy and also metabolism. It is important because it acts as a cofactor in the conversion of nutrients into energy, particularly in the form of ATP. Furthermore, NAD plus is involved in the regulation of over 500 enzymatic reactions, including DNA repair, cell cycle and also detoxification. The NADH the, is the reduced form from NAD+. This compound is the strongest electron donor or antioxidant in the human body and is very reactive. It oxidizes easily in the stomach but thanks to plant fats and chlorophyll which ensure that this component reaches the intestines it is absorbed there in a biologically active form. These are the small black and also green dots you can see in the powder. And finally, resveratrol. Resveratrol is a compound found in some plants with high antioxidant properties. In addition, it has been found that resveratrol stimulates the activity of enzymes responsible for the production of NAD. By influencing NAD metabolism, resveratrol may potentially have positive effects on metabolism and cell health. In summary, we can positively influence our energy and metabolism with smart supplements, while also remembering the important things in life and focusing on the essentials to gradually achieve a healthier lifestyle, namely with a health, with a healthy mindset, love and a pinch of humor. <laughs> you can see how complex your energy product production is and how we can support this fascinating biochemical processes so that we can breathe, live and also love. And as you all know, energy is power. And talking about power, there is another really exciting MetaPower product that is coming to Europe later this year, the MetaPower Recharge. If you would like to learn more about it during this convention, join Dr. Fernando, Dr. O, and myself tomorrow for the second snack session on this stage at 2.50. PM. Thank you so much and enjoy the rest of this beautiful